Hey Shopify users, in this video I will show you how you can move the description on the Shopify product page from this section on the right to under the image. So I'll be doing this on the Dawn theme but I believe this should work on all the other free themes and also if you're using some other paid theme and you're trying to achieve the same the same concepts should work so let's get into the video so first let's open the customizer in a new tab and then also open the code area so click on this and here's your edit code all right so now I'm gonna go to the product page so here we are so as you can see I have added a bunch of text on the side maybe some people don't need that much text and they're fine with it but I think if you're trying to do SEO and stuff you need some content on the page so you need some text and if you add all that text on the side this description here it gets too long and I don't think it looks good so to me a good solution is to if this could be moved right under the image either we could move the whole thing or keep some text here and then have some text under here all right so first one uh, let's get into the code area here you're gonna search for a main dash product dot liquid and it should be in the sections folder so I have it already open in here search for description it's right here so this is the area that shows the description for now just to be safe in the beginning just turn this description off so let me go to the customize area and product information right here we have description and I'm going to just hide this so now you are not seeing any description here all right so back to the code and what I'm gonna do now is go all the way down where you see this end of product info it should be all the way down here right before the schema right here this you can see this closing tag product info and what you will do is just hit enter here and then I am going to paste some code in here so here's the code and let's save this now and let's take a look in the preview okay so there you go you are seeing all the code this is in my product description okay so that was the first method now in this we still see this space here now now if you have any other elements here and this is not looking all this blank so then then I guess it's fine otherwise I guess we've solved the issue of long text but now this area looks ugly so I think the best solution for me um, is to have some text here and then have more text if you need put that down here so how are we going to achieve that go to the product pick any of the products so I'm gonna go back to the product I was working with so in here right in the corner you see the show HTML you're going to click on that and then now it shows you the code and right after this first paragraph right here uh, hit enter and you're going to write this oops So this is an HTML comment. This doesn't show on the page. This is just for developers to have a comment. We are gonna do something with this. And for now, just save it. So up here, click save. And now let's go back into the code. So back to where we entered this code, down here, 
right here in description and then down here in this part right here you are going to write this so this pipe split with this and this here I put in split because it just made sense but you can write anything this just needs to match whatever you enter on the product right here so it needs to exactly match this and why I have it like this is because it's a comment if you put in anything else it's gonna start to show in there so I this might not make sense right now to you uh, keep watching it will make more sense so for now just put this in there and then have the same thing in here like this and then there's a pipe sign and then the last so what we are trying to do here is we are going to split that description up we're telling Shopify to split it up and then the last part of it so the last part is whatever comes afterwards put that in this area and of course the first part needs to go on the the other area where the default uh, spot is so what we're gonna do is for now I'm just gonna copy this from here like this search for description previous where is it right there so this is the default area where the description shows so right in here I'm going to paste what I just copied from below and here we're telling it to okay split that description but output the first part of it so I'm gonna change this to first so one thing I noticed that this here you see this there's no space and if I go back to what we entered here, this has space. So this needs to exactly match, otherwise it's not gonna work. So keep that in mind. I'm going to get rid of this space here. And now let's take a look at this in the browser. Look at that. So it has split it right at that spot and put the rest down here just to double check right here see the parentheses exactly that's where it split the text and all right so that's that so now you're gonna see still see this it's still too long so you're gonna have to play with this a bit right so you need to adjust this to where it's not too much text down here so what i could do is uh, go in here so if you made this shorter you could move this text down in this area create a new heading whatever you want to do you know you need to play around and uh, i'm going to get rid of say this much text from here save it and then refresh and it didn't save yet refresh again okay so there we go so now much better right yeah so a little text here there's no weird scrolling going on and I mean some people might say that scrolling isn't that bad I mean but hey I don't know I, I like it like this so there you go um, and that's it that's all you have to do to enter some more text and don't you know your page still looks fine and enter as much text you want here that's it guys if you like the video please leave me a like subscribe to the channel and I will see you in the next video